what's going on youtube gary here crazy for cardboard figured we'd do it a little different today instead of going live i only go live monday through friday for the auctions and the hobby chat and whatever else we get into give another shout out to my buddy there joe iphone services hooked me up with the two of ten banana eating junkie there aka the monkey card love that thing it's brought me some good luck so far but got a little screw down protector so give me a little monkey rub there get some of that luck going because we have a couple mail days here i was gonna wait and do a monday but i can't wait that damn long y'all know me i love me some mail days Teflis 45 rocking it over there at the uh natty up in uh rosemont illinois so yep i think i know what's in this one card in this at least and i think it's some auction stuff before he went to the natty but where's my skizzers at i'm gonna use skizzers today all the cards are down there so i'm not gonna damage anything snipping the snipping the tip there so we'll put a little scissor action on this and i know i got a one of my georgia bulldog pc hits coming that he hooked me up with Ooh, we got three cards in here nice and a team bag right on right on so i know that's the auction i remember that card I got an extra bubble mailer so that's always a plus the team bag is actually a hit as well I love team bags. I need to order some today if I don't think about it. So we'll put that over there. And all these are sexy sexies. So first off, Eric Hosmer, 276 out of 299. Panini Prism. Bam. Look at that Joker, man. That fluorescent lighting, man. If y'all ain't got fluorescent lighting. You'll see your cards in a whole different, whole different shine, man. Look at that. Boom shakalaka. And next but not least, oh, there's the PC hit. That's a sexy one. Another Eric Hosmer. Another Prism. And this one is numbered out of 75. 73 of 75. Check that out. That's sexy. I live south of Kansas City in Peculiar, Missouri for a while, driving truck for a living, so I got to see a good bit of royal stuff. Andrew McCutcheon. This is what the hell is this? Tops. I don't know that card. That's awesome though. I'm not sure what card set that is. What card set is that, guys? It's 2018 top something. I can't remember. But that's a sexy card. I like Andrew McCutcheon. Then we got a Goldie. Slide to the bottom there. I gotta look this card up and see what the, see what kind of top set is. I don't recall that one's not numbered, but it's still cool. I like me some Goldie. I got a couple more cards of him coming in his Cardinals Uni. So the monkey is uh, doing his job. Appreciate you, Joe. One more time. Can't say it enough, man. Joe iPhone Services. Y'all go check him out. He does some great videos. Kind of quiet, but... <laughs> Bell Trey out of 10, dude. Look at that. Is that 10 or 13? That's 10. So number three of 10, 3,000 hit club and 450 long ball frats in 2017. Fourth player to amass 3,000 hits, 450 homers and 600 doubles in a career. Five fielding awards, four silver slugger awards. And he's only behind Brooks Robinson at defensive plays at third base. At 509 outs recorded. That's pretty solid, dude. That's Hall of Fame for sure. 
don't think he's in yet, but he will be. And Georgia Bulldog, baby. Miko Hardman Jr. Now with the Broncos. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Contenders, draft picks, auto. Nice. <clears throat> Boy, Deafness hooked it up, man. I love you, brother. Rookie card, sexy auto. And he got the best helmet in the league. Got a big G on it. So that one is definitely a PC forever. Man, that's nice. So if y'all got some Georgia Bulldogs laying around, you can get my address on the about page. Just hook it up. Let me know what the price is, and I will get it to you. Or let me know what your PC is, and I can hook you up with some trade stuff or whatever you want, man. I want every Georgia Bulldog card in the world in my house. <laughs> <laughs> and next, but certainly not least... A thick, a thick, thick, thick package that I don't recall ordering so much stuff. But that is my buddy out in Colorado there. RSR Cards and Collectibles. They do an auction every Sunday. I want to say it's 3 p.m. Eastern, 1 o'clock Colorado time, mountain time. But y'all have to check that out and verify that. Oh, damn, look at that. We got some loveliness in there. Got a note there. We'll read that. Holy snakies, dude. Look at all this stuff. I ordered a few cards from the hit uh, auction, but I don't know what all this stuff is. I asked for Georgia Bulldogs cards. If he had some laying around. But we talked yesterday, and <laughs> he said he got he got busy packing and forgot to put the Georgia stuff in the box. So he's going to send those in a separate package. That's cool, man. I love you, brother. Y'all do good stuff. Very good stuff. And congratulations, early congratulations on your retirement. I heard that yesterday or the day before. I can't remember. But congratulations, brother. That's a big, that's a big deal. Hope you enjoy your retirement, brother. Let me see. Thank you for supporting our channel. We've included some extra Georgia Bulldogs cards, RSR, Rob, and Bubba. And like I said, if y'all haven't seen them yet, I don't know what your problem is. Sunday, 3 Eastern. I believe that's correct. Rob, y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but I think, I believe you said 3 o'clock Eastern time. So we're going to crack this tape open here. All you young cats out there in the shipping business. Or in the card shipping business, rather. Oh, dang, dude. That's some net. Oh, man. I got team bags. <laughs> oh, dude. I love you guys. Y'all are awesome. Y'all heard my cries. <laughs> and that cardboard will be reused because I've never got enough cardboard. I like protecting my stuff really well. If you'll go check out their mail day that they did in honor of my box that I mailed them. You'll notice that I pack stuff really, really tight. And I love it. I love packing stuff good. I don't want anything damaged. I send out some damaged stuff every now and then, but it's for free. I don't I don't sell it. So just know. Just know that the cards are worth protecting if they're worth sending. Oh dang, dude, these are nice, man. Y'all don't understand, bro. <laughs> I am so short on supplies right now from people buying all my stuff. Holy crap, dude, this is awesome. Prior to this package, this is what I had left. <laughs> there might be 15 top loaders in there. I thought I was down to like eight or nine, but I found some in a box that had some, uh... so yeah, we got five, 10, 15, 20 there's 20 in that stack that's considered 20 hits guys Ooh, excuse me I just had some Hardee's bacon egg and cheese biscuits dude Rob man you're awesome man you and Bubba hooked it up dude I cannot thank you enough I'm one of the nerdy guys that loves getting supplies 
like I said, if you're going to ship stuff, make sure it's protected. Not every card has to be in the top loader, but at least sandwich the cards in between top loaders. I'm going to save the cardboard slabs there. I ship a lot of stuff. So those will definitely come in handy. Who'd ever thought that uh, top loaders and uh, team bags and cardboard would be a hit? <laughs> Oh, there's a Georgia Bulldog on top, man. And it's a Sony. I loved last year's Super Bowl, man. Sony Michelle and Todd Gurley both running back, backfield. For both teams were Georgia Bulldogs. I love that. All right. Oh, there's a Matthew Stafford on the back. You guys are the bomb diggums. Dude, sleeves. Nice, my man. Those will be going into my sleeve box. Show you how we do that. Very cool, very cool. Got a pack of sleeves here. Sleeves I'm not short of, but there's never enough. See that? That's all sleeves, man. Raining plastic, raining plastic. But yeah. <laughs> and here we have a hundred team bags. That is awesome too. Very nice. So we will snip that bag and put that in the team bag box. I'm still going to sleeve all the cards I send out, 99% of them. <clears throat> so we'll put that in the team bag box over there, put that in the trash can. Nice, nice. So yeah, we got team bags, baby. Very cool. Very, very, very cool. And of course, we got our bulldog piles still to go through. Rob and Bubba, I thank you. You have no idea how much I've been wanting to order some of those. I just haven't found a big enough lot. I've seen a few thousand lots, but I need a lot more than that. <laughs> but that'll help. That'll definitely help. And for my Bulldog, we got 2018 Sage Hit Sony Michelle, Riley Ridley, Calvin's younger brother tearing it up for my dogs, Draft Kings, or Touchdown Kings Leaf Draft, that's cool. Very, very nice. Herschel Baby, oh my god, nice. That is some sexy stuff right there. Got us our 1980 title. Very nice, very nice. Field Vision Matthew Stafford, probably one of the strongest arms ever to see in the league, other than Elway, perhaps. Dude can actually absolutely sling that ball, man. I just wish he had some better offenses around him. He's always had receivers and stuff, but his line kind of let the Detroit guys down for a long time. Plus, our defense really couldn't stop anybody, so that doesn't help at all. But, yeah, the original Matty Ice, <laughs> to me, anyway. I'm a Falcons fan, too. We got Matt Ryan in Atlanta. Not going to burn you alive, but he's a high-percentage passer. Consistency kills, baby. But, yeah, just a quick recap. Bell trade of 10, Goldsmith. McCutcheon, Eric Hosmer, number to 75, and then number to 299, Hosmer. Got the red and the silver prisms there. Those are sexy joints, man. So, Deafness, thank you very much, kind sir. I saw your video this morning, and I agree. The hobby doesn't, doesn't need that kind of crap going on in the background. 
it's depressing. It pisses you off, certainly, that grown people will act like that towards other hobbyists. I don't understand it. I don't support it. I know not many, not many people go around doing stuff like that. So yeah, it definitely casts some shade on the hobby. I don't know who was involved. I don't care. I don't want to know, but grow up people. What one guy does on his channel ain't nobody's business. If you don't want to see it, turn the shit off. That's all I got to say. Def, love you, brother. Rob, love you guys. Keep doing what you're doing. I'll see you Sunday. And I'll see the rest of you guys Monday morning. Monday through Friday, 10 a.m. Eastern. General hobby chat. Come in. We try to keep it clean, but we say some dirty words. We try to watch our mouth, but, you know, it's the internet. You're going to see stuff like that. Can't really avoid it. I wish I could, but the best I can do is say I promise to try not to let any really, really, really vulgar stuff come out, but I'm human, guys. We all are human, but don't go to the website anymore. I shut it down a couple of days ago. I'm in the process of researching websites, and I will be opening another one. It's going to be a different name, but the crazy, crazy for hardball will always be my social media and my uh, YouTube stuff, so that's not going to change. It's just the website's going to change. Still going to have crazy in there somewhere, but I don't know. But yeah, probably going to sponsor a giveaway here shortly. We're we're coming up on another big milestone for me personally in the uh, the analytics side of things, the monetization side of things. But yeah, y'all be look out for that giveaway video, and then hopefully I will see you Monday morning at ten o'clock in the hobby chat on my channel here. Please tell your friends tell your collector buddies a lot of cheap auctions a lot of make me an offer type stuff i really don't care about the money side of it i just want to flip stuff and bring more stuff into the shop so y'all have a good weekend be safe all you guys at the natty make sure you're uh make sure you're taking care of yourself guys a lot of walking a lot of sweating i imagine it looks hotter than hell in there but we are going to get out of here. I appreciate you watching. Like, subscribe if you haven't already. Love you guys. And yeah, I'm about to kick back and wash some tubes. See if I can find a football schedule. See if there's any football on the tube today. Fingers crossed. But y'all be good or be good at it. See you.